We are making wonderful smells. I mean, this is really incredible. What we're doing is we're getting ready to do a roast. And we're going to make this roast the best I know how to make it. And you can do it too because it's real simple. What we did is we started with onions, bell pepper, and celery, and garlic. And we put half of it in. And you can see the beautiful color that's on that first half. We've been cooking it. And so it's ready. Now we're going to add the second half to it. The reason to do that is because it stages the taste. In other words, the first half that I've got in here that with that real dark brown color is really sweet and it tastes just absolutely wonderful. But it's still onions and bell pepper and celery. Now I'm adding the second half which is going to have a little more texture and it's going to have a little different or a slightly different taste to it and it's going to be uh, a, a little crunchier. But we're going to take that and now we're going to stuff this roast with it. And you see me with a knife. I'm cutting slits and, and literally making pockets. See how deep my finger goes in there? I'm making pockets and filling them up with this incredible substance with herbs and spices in it that just smells and is going to make this roast absolutely wonderful. If you've never had a roast like this, you don't know what you're missing. Now, for, for the people that are out there, and I know there's a lot of you got garlic freaks, you know, what I do is I take, when, when I'm cooking for garlic lovers, I take and put a clove of garlic first and then shove it down in there and then put the seasoning right on top. And you just continue to do that until all the holes are full. And then you take, after it, all the holes are full, you take whatever's left and you put it right on top like you see me doing here and you just rub it in. Oh, does that feel wonderful and that's going to taste so good. And then you put it in the oven at 225 degrees until it's done. And I'll tell you, you've never tasted anything like this. And that's good cooking, good eating, and good loving. We love you guys out there. Yes, get a roast and make it happen.